what's wrong? You're worried about me. You look at me and say, Mr. Stephen looks so tired. I hope he's okay. <laughs> I, and, and, yeah. I'm not okay. I'm not okay. All right. Homework first. Do you have the electricity uh, resistance and resistors, wasn't it? Yeah. So let's do that first, please. How many questions was that? Four questions? Four questions, right. Um, do you have the first question, sir? There we go. Right, uh, Iyad. Sorry, not Iyad. Yeah, Iyad, sorry. Do you, you have the question there, do you? Yeah. Or does anyone have it handy? Do you have the questions? Yeah, I have it. Uh, two amps. Yeah. The maker is connected to 440 volts. Yeah. Supply of electricity. Yeah. What is the resistance of Copy okay, no problem. So the R equals V over I, which is 240 over 2, which is 120 ohms. Got that? Yeah. Yep. 2, what's number 2, Andy? A voltmeter is mm -hmm. placed around a small 1 amp electrical heater. Mm -hmm. The voltmeter shows that 110 volts were consumed by mm -hmm. the heater. What is the response of the heater? Oh, I made these questions too easy. Um, 110? Yeah. yeah, okay, number three. Uh, one kilo ohm register has a voltmeter placed around it. The voltmeter shows a voltage of 100 volts. If a um, meter mm -hmm. is connected to the register, it would show how much current. Okay, so we want the current now. That's V over R. 0 0.1 amps. Yeah. Yeah. And lastly, number four. Your teacher's mobile phone is powered by uh, 3.7 volt battery and uh, Battery states that it can provide a current of 800 milli amps. amps. Yeah. 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 What is? What's the question? Uh, what is the resistance? Th therefore, what is the value of the resistance? Yeah. The yeah. V over I, 3.7 over 0 0.8, whatever the heck that is. 4.625. 4.625. Oh, does the B part? Yeah. Yeah. All right. B. If the phone was replaced by a better, more powerful smartphone, but the battery kept the same, then do you expect the response to be larger or smaller? Yeah. So what do you think? Yeah. If you smaller. you think smaller, yeah. The, the resistance will it be bigger or smaller? Yeah, well, let's see. Yeah, let's let's imagine some numbers. So this is the old phone, yeah, and it's 3.7 volt battery and 800 milliamps. And then we have the new phone, and it's 3.7 volt battery, um, and we don't know what the more, yeah. current is. Yeah. Why did I give you this question? Because uh, I mean, the, the newer phone. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> the newer phone would use more current, I think. Yeah. Advanced, so it would use yeah. R equals V over I. <coughs> the V stays the same. But the I is high, so the I is small. Yeah. It's not directly proportional. They are inversely. Yeah, maybe I didn't... Did I say a new phone, but the same battery? Yeah. Yeah. And what did I ask? What happened with the I? The R. The R? No, delete the question. It's a stupid question. The question has been deleted. 
Yeah, I don't like it. It's stupid. I don't know why I wrote it. I don't know why I wrote it. Delete the question. Why I don't like it. Why is it stupid? I don't like it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, why is it stupid? I, I, I don't like it. I, Let's I, imagine then. Right, okay, we'll imagine then. No, we, we'll, we'll try and do it then. Um, so your choices are... This is going to stay the same. You can't change this. This is the same. So the R will get bigger if the I gets smaller, and the R will get smaller when the I, when the I gets bigger. So if you want to know what happens here, you need to know what happens here. But the problem is we don't know what happens here. Okay, but the problem that R is okay, yeah. bigger or smaller. An advanced, no, uh, an advanced form, we use more in sequence or not? Well, this is, this is, I think, what I didn't really tell you. If the phone... The, the answer doesn't have to do with this. This is why I said the question was stupid. The answer has to do with what you understand the OR is. So if you have an old phone and a new phone, the OR in the new phone will be... Less. Now, why are you saying less, though? No, it doesn't. You see, this is the thing. A smartphone uses more energy yeah. because it has more features. So do you remember uh, ohm is one joule per coulomb. So if you have uh, a smartphone, it wants to use more energy, doesn't it? Yeah, so the ore will be bigger for a smartphone because it's a more powerful phone. Uh, what I wanted you to understand, do you see here, um, this, what was 4A? The resistance is 4.6. Yeah. And what was number 3? Was it a, a heater or something? Um. It was a heater, wasn't it? Oh, I didn't say what it was? Just the one kilo. Um, right. What was number 1? What was question 1 about? Coffee maker. So coffee maker is 120 ohms. And number two, what was number two about? The electric heater. The electric heater, and that was 110 ohms. Uh, number three, I didn't say what it was, but it was something big, one kilo ohm. Yeah. And for the following, it's quite small, 4.65. So what I want you to understand in your head is that if the OR is big, it means a lot of energy is being used. So when I say which is a bigger one, the smartphone or the old phone, the smartphone is a more energy hungry machine than an old phone. So this is why the ore is bigger. So I think I understand I understand why I put this question in, because I want you to understand what the ore is. You might be thinking that the ore is something bad. That if the ore is big, it means it's not good, it's yeah. bad. But it's not like this. If the ore is big, it just means a lot of energy is being used. And that can be a good thing. Like if the energy is being used to make your laptop work. You know? So a big ore is not a bad thing. It just means a lot of energy is being used. Maybe no, but it could, yeah, but like, this is the point. Just because the ore is big, you don't know if it's good or bad. So for my laptop, it's good. But maybe for a light bulb it's bad because a lot of it's being wasted as heat. Yeah. All you know is a lot is being used because you don't know how well it's being used. So a big ore is not automatically bad. A big ore is just a big ore. It could just be a good thing or a bad thing. So I think for a smartphone the ore will be bigger because it will want to use more energy. Yeah, yeah? More light. More light, more sound, more yeah. process and more energy. More screen. Yeah. Okay, is this is this okay? Yeah. Um, what do you think? Happy, unhappy? What's what's this? Speak. Tell me how you feel. Terms of life. Yeah. <laughs> no. If the ore is going to be big, that means um, a lot of energy used. So if you have a new phone, it has a big screen and lots of sound and lots of energy. So it means the ore is big. 
If you have an old phone, like my phone, the R will be small because it just has a little sound and a little light. You know? So I don't know if it actually says it on my phone. I'll have to check. Maybe we can check. Um, 3.7 Seven hundred milliamp, two point six. No, it doesn't say what the resistance is. Sometimes it says what the resistance is on these things, but it doesn't. I feel that it'll be bigger on your phone than my phone. Is my point. Okay. Is that okay? Yes. Okay. No, you said it'd be smaller. Yeah, because in in question B it says the I is. No. No. In I. Wait, is that that? Yeah. Oh, you didn't tell me this. No, wait. <laughs> you can't trust them. That's the problem. I don't remember. I don't remember that being there. Yeah. Phone was replaced by a better, more powerful smartphone, but the battery kept the same. Then they expect the resistance to be larger or smaller, that's it. Okay. No, it doesn't say anything about I. No, it's more. Um, oh. I think more power is mean more I. That's what I thought too, but it didn't say. Anything. Not necessarily. We haven't done <laughs> power yet. <coughs> uh, yeah, I understand what you mean. More power means more I. Yes. In fact, it's usually more power means more or. Yeah. So that basically means less I? It could. It depends on the voltage. The problem is we haven't done the formula for power yet. So this is why you don't know. Uh, and we'll do that, uh, I don't know, maybe that's today. We'll do the formula for power. But we haven't done it yet. Okay. Um, We'll do it. We'll do, we'll do it when we get to it. There is a power section, of course. All right. 